So the Fuji XS10, got a new firmware update. I'm going to update it now. I've got it switched on, fully charged battery. <coughs> First thing, we'll connect with the phone. So let me show you doing that. So we connect to the Fuji X app, and it will take a few seconds to connect to the X10, of course. And what you will see on the top right there in green, new firmware for the camera, uh, camera is available. Click on that, I think, is that right? No, click on the three dots. Scroll down to the bottom, and you can see we have the option to upgrade the firmware. Click on that option, agree to the license, and then just be patient while it does the download, and then the update. So what we've got now, let me show you. Hopefully you can see that. It's receiving on the camera. And when that firmware update is fully transferred, it will update, takes a few seconds. Uh, it's sending it to the firmware, the firmware to the camera now. And as soon as this is done, I'm having a cup of tea and a bacon sandwich and my wife is waiting patiently, making no noise while I'm filming this. And as soon as I've finished filming, I'm going to be in trouble for making her wait. This is what it's like when you're a YouTuber. She's laughing now, you can't see. <laughs> so that's just about transferred. And in a second, yep, so it's upgrading. We can finish the screen. And hopefully, you're getting glare there. But uh, what we're seeing, or what I'm seeing, is that the dots at the bottom are filling in black. And as it completes each one, we're getting closer to the finishing um, upgrade. It will finish and tell you to turn the camera off. So we're all completed, we're on 3.11. I don't know if I can show you that picture any better. I'll try to take a photograph, uh, but that's all it does, all you need to do rather. Very simple, very straightforward, do it from the app. This uh, is fairly new firmware, so it's worth updating. Slightly better autofocus, that kind of a thing. Thanks for watching.